Following the deadly attack in Maiduguri where an army general and three soldiers were killed by Islamic State of West Africa province ISWAB, uh, a security expert says the government needs to do more and re-strategize in overhauling the military. Jacinta Obuku brings details in this report. In Nigeria, the spate of insecurity, especially in the northeast, is alarming. An Islamic State West Africa province which split from Boko Haram in 2016 and pledged allegiance to Islamic State has been fighting against the Nigerian armed forces. This time in Medjugri, Iswap killed a Nigerian brigadier general and three soldiers in an attack. Security expert Okechuku Nwangoma said the attack shows the need for government to beef up the approach in the fight against insecurity. We still have capacity above our, our military, and that is why they seem to be having the upper hand. Every now and then, these people are attacking sensitive military you know, facilities, killing our soldiers, abducting them. We need to raise at the guys to think of other ways of enhancing the, cap the capability of our military forces so that we don't continue to lose our military you know, resources, our men and the women in the military. He opined that the government also needs to admit overwhelming challenges and limitations in the capacity of military resources. If government will not continue to claim successes that they have not achieved or capacity that, that, that we don't have, unless government is, is, is ready to admit that there is limitation in the capacity and to seek help from where they can. You know, unless that happens, then we will not, because the tendency is for government to always say we are on top of the situation, and that is the, the usual la language. According to United Nations, Bonus State is at the center of the Islamist insurgency, which has spilled into neighboring Chad and Cameroon and has left about 300,000 people dead and millions dependent on aid. Jacinta Ubuku for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.